for another mod. Lock the two screws. The face should be uh, same like this. Nice. We move out the air, then we press this down, and we screw the another one. Not sure I can see it, huh? But they go ban. Yeah, this one. Okay. Yeah. And also this surface should be the same uh, now, put this one yeah. into this cylinder, lock it. We need to check if when this coming down, it's uh, punching the face or not. See, like this, then it's correct. Okay, you can put one cardboard inside like this and then move. Move like this, a little bit hard. Like this that. one, put back side. Put here, like this way. After you fix this, then you pull it inside. Leave some space for the paper. Yeah, put like this and uh, go back a little bit. Go back a little bit. Yeah. Okay, leave a little bit for the paper. For example, like this, so can fold the paper. Then you lock this screw. After, then you connect the, the air. Huh? Then it's coming out. Then you put this inside and lock it with the three screws. Like this, you lock it. We go to the operation A, and we go next play uh, next page. And we go the last, last nine, and the, the third one, yeah, for, for that one. See, we use this one to go. See, the the surface is not smooth. It's not equal. It's not at the same level. Then we go to the back side. Now see this one, this one you, you turn it. Okay, it's one. See? This is lower. Turn down a little. Okay. So we come back side. How like? And we lock it. Lock it. Lock this screw and this screw. Like this. Lock it. Same way for up. So now this is movable like this way. So you just make it like this. You give the uh, gap and, and five or five or six millimeter. Then after that, you go to the back side to lock this two screw because this is that one which we pressed. You lock from here. Uh, now I need to put it same level. Then we lock it, lock it again. After that, we check it again if the it's the same level or not. If it's not, then you change from the back side. After we sit like this, then we open this one and uh, unlock this screw. Okay, we uh, we turn it. Make it come out. Uh, and uh, the same way, the same way from this side.
make it back make it back okay now we press this down make this mold come down see like this see when this uh, we need this face equal to this this side like this then we go to the station we go to the operation a okay and we go next page mm -hmm. now we turn down the left press and the right press at the same oh. time ah. okay so yeah, like this. Okay. Now, two Okay, like this. So we just uh, turn it and uh, make this. Uh, okay, turn it. Coming inside. Yeah, like this. When it's touching, when you feeling it's pressing on this cardboard a little bit tight, then you can lock it. Uh, you lock it like that way and uh, this side the same way to after uh, that then you release the air and then you can press this cylinder and goes in the middle of the mold check now the the black brush between this surface is the space is too much so now you need to use the this one up Okay, okay, see this is too much you need to give a little bit more uh, space for the paper Like this, the black uh, brush just uh, touching this mold That's Okay, so we go back So in this page, here is the uh, number is showing the position of the mold So what we need to do is just uh, here, uh, just uh, writing this number into this one, the position of uh, molding. One, two, three. The third one. Just to change, you change this number to here. To, to this number. Like this. Yes. Then you can change the number. And 27163. Then you press it back to original position and you press this side inside. So now we connect with the we connect with the air now. So it's then we go to next page. Okay, so we release this two A a left and now we go to this one. Not the not the night one two three four five the five. So this one is for the button card uh, deliver so i will sh we press it then it will be come like this okay so when this situation we press this use this remove goes down put the more goes down to see this one there here have one this so this button should be higher than this mark uh, three then we and release it so it's coming down then we go back then we change this number and so we write this number in this one two three four number four uh, bottom card position is 323.78 323.78 So now we are setting the bottom card. See this is big. So Just we need to release this screw. And also here have a screw. So we increase the size. Nah. If I turn this. like this okay then we lock so we lock it as the same size as the as the we lose these two oh. 
Now this side is okay now, but that that guider is small now. So we need to change the setup. Here, uh, this one and this one, there have two screws. You need to See, these two screws. Release it. Okay. Nibad, Then after you release the screw, they will take it out. Okay. Nato. Uh -huh. Then you remove the air and now you can move it. Yeah, you can move it like this. This should be this. This one should be same like this one. This one should be same like this one. Push it like straight. This guider, the size should be same like this. So you can put the cart and put put the cart like this. You can work, move like this if it's correct. Now knock the screws. Then connecting, connect the air. The next page. And okay. This button means uh, uh, button cart deliver. Uh, like this. Dog. When you press it, it goes inside and like this. You unlock this screw. So this we one. deliver this inside. So after that, we take this cardboard like this, and uh, we press this like this way. We then we take out the cardboard and we lock, we lock it. After we come back, we put this cardboard inside and uh, we put on this to uh, uh, to tie the uh, bottom and lock it. If the cardboard thickness is too low, then you can release these screws. So you push the cardboard here then you just uh, put it down you put it down and leave a little bit gap like this way to ensure the cardboard can move out smoothly same way for this side okay now it's becoming like this mm. Mm. It was. Yeah, we like put this. some more uh, cut, uh, button cards like this. Then we go back and uh, go back. Then we reset the iron. Okay. Then we uh, go back to original position. Now we go single trial now. Now the it's not correct because this face should be same level and here so that means the mold is too high so we need to now know we it. go to the the this uh, operating A and we check the bottom card uh, height is like this so it is uh, on here is showing maybe three millimeters uh, height than the bottom card so. Now it is uh, 3 to 378. We need to change it minus 3 to 0. So we need to increase 3 to 6.78. 3 to 6.78. Then we go back. Okay, we reset. After that, we do one more single try. Okay. So now it is 
at the same level see so it's correct okay, now we put one box on it and we go to the page uh one minute we go to the operating uh, pay, uh a and we go we go to this the, uh forming uh position we use the remove to go down during the time it goes down the number is changing okay it's too much yeah, yeah like this almost the same number then it's fine yeah like this way then we press next page and uh, we turn on the left and the right pressing button and the, the the last one the left and right uh, side forward see th this and this is the last uh, one left and right uh, folding now we are putting this ear folding part inside these two this face should be same level as the box top and also this one should be maybe 20 percent of this box to cover like this and you can move remove this uh, screw you can move this side this side and this side if then we to. release everything then we move it up then we go to the down position uh, setting this night should be on shall I yeah if it's not on then you just move it uh, up or down lower to make it on then lock it from top and goes lower until up. the lights on please then remember to put oil for the lubrication oil on this guider and uh, this guider from the button yeah this this this, guy the, this screws after three or four days you need to change uh, check if it's still locked or not because sometimes maybe it will be ready